Arizona um, for a fire heart promotion today. I'm here with Keenan Carbajal. Now, Keenan, you got the W. Take the, take the fans through your fight. Uh, you know what? He was, he, he was a tough opponent. I mean, he couldn't let his record fool you. The guy was nine wins, 17 losses, but at the end of the day, that's 28 fights. So, I mean, that's a lot of ring experience compared to my nine. And um, I, I heard him a couple times, and he, I mean, his experience carried him through, and that, that's, that's just how the fight went every round. It was a unanimous decision. I, I won pretty much every round. Uh, just, I just had to stay on the outside. Jab a lot, jab a lot. There was a couple dull moments, but I just didn't see why engage in, in a brawl when he's 5'5", five, five, and I had about five inches on him. Yeah, I think it was like the third round. Um, he was trying, to, or second round, he was trying to toy with you, trying to bait you to come in. Yeah. And then at the end of the round, you guys had a rally, and then he looked at you and kind of smirked, and you smirked at him. What yeah. was going through your mind uh, when that happened? Yeah, because I knew, I knew if I connect, I'm gonna hurt him. And uh, I knew I, that didn't get to me. I, I just stay on the outside, stay on the outside, because what am I gonna jump in for and get caught? What am I gonna, what am I gonna hey, give him my, my advantages? Thank you. And uh, he tried to bait me in it. It didn't work. And, and as you can see at the end of the round, I, I think I got the better of every exchange. I mean, don't get me wrong, there's a couple times where he caught me, but I think overall I got the better of every exchange. So I didn't I didn't let him just bait me in like that. Now your fellow teammate, uh, Paul Romero, just got the W. You um, Explain the, the preparation, because you just told me that you helped him get ready for Jair Contento, and he helped you get ready for this opponent. Yeah, yeah, no, we helped each other, and I mean, the, the rounds we were putting in with each other, there was nobody that was gonna beat us. And uh, I'm happy for Ziggy, I mean, I'm sure likewise he's happy for me, and I mean, I'm, I'm, good. I'm glad that we both got the W today. Um, you know what, he's, just, he's a tremendous fighter, and that's why we picked him to get ready for this fight. Now, what do you have to say to your family and your friends that came here to support you? You know, little familia, I, I couldn't do this without you. I mean, the support, the support I get walking into the ring, I mean, you hear that crowd, they go crazy. And that just, I, I feel like I just levitate, and I mean, I just, I feel like a, an invincible in that ring. And I, I couldn't feel that way without you guys. Thank you. Now, uh, Keenan, if I wanted to follow your career, as you become a... As your journey to become a world champion, how, how am I able to do that? Uh, you follow me on Instagram and Facebook at Keenan Carbone. There we go. Keenan, man, you, you got the W. Um, you didn't get the knockdown, but I, I'll still I'll still take you up on that guy, donut deal, man. We'll, you, we'll, did you see that guy? I hit him with so many hard yeah, shots. Yeah, man, he could take a punch. It was so crazy because like I hit him, and I would see him stun, and then I hit him again. It's like he woke up. It was, like, it was the craziest thing. Now, like I said, I think it was his experience. He had over 20 fights, and, and his age, he was a little bit older than me. I mean, there's no excuse, but he just he was a tough fighter. He's just one of those guys you ain't going to get rid of too easy. Yeah, but uh, hey, I'll still take you on that donut place, man. I, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna, I'm hungry for some donuts, man. Let's go, let's go. <laughs> We're gonna go get a dozen tomorrow. Exactly. Uh, well, I'm here in Glendale, Arizona for Fire Heart Promotions event. Here with Keenan Carbajal. Thank you for this, y'all.